Hello, everyone, and welcome to the third annual Halloween, second annual. Does anyone know? Does anyone have that information? But honestly, what an amazing Halloween event this has been. Yes, applause all around. Applause all around. Absolutely. Fantastic streamers. We are going to have a few of those 2022 Halloween event alumni on this stream kind of bringing it all back and around we're going to try and get some thoughts on the event so far and also we're going to get some fun halloween memories of our past but to introduce the person that you just saw so there's no real need for an introduction but we're going to do it anyway we got laird forbes hello Hi Laird, how was your stream five minutes ago? It, it was ace. It, it's, it's a pity I don't know how to play the game. It's all right. You playing games is just enough. Seeing you struggle, seeing you being chased down by bloodthirsty zombies and stop to take a drink is delightful. <laughs> it's all we need. All right, all up about next. The drink. Yeah, I mean, as long as, long as you got, 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 got a drink, you know. Um, Fraggle underscore pop a dmg affiliate a sort of outlier for the time being but we're dragging her in to get her out cheer and I'd like to give you a big round of applause for that so say hi fragment <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's adorable so wait when did you become a vtuber uh it's only been a few months now and how's that experience I went the been? cheap route. You went it's the cheap great. route. Mm -hmm. So I get to play around with assets and change my scenes, add little things on there, little drinks and whatnot. I awesome. <laughs> Excellent. And next, one of my favorite human beings in the world. Her streams will leave your side split and a big old smile on your face. It is the one, the only, Shy the Trash Panda. <laughs> And her adorable son. Hi. Huh? Hello, everybody. Hi, Shy. How are you? Hi. I'm good. How are you? I hear through the whispering of the Great Pumpkin that you got a brand new PC. The Great Pumpkin is correct. Mm -hmm. It just came in. I literally had to chase down the UPS guy as I was getting home so that I could get it today i did not want to wait another day did, did you like stick it in reverse drive it and just tom cruise that shit i uh literally threw my foot on the gas pedal and i chased it down the street because i was talking to him on the door ring doorbell and he still left anyways <laughs> i was like bro i was right here well I am so glad you got your PC. I am excited to see some more streams coming from you because I know you're getting tired of that Xbox console baloney. You're going to be more playing more games with us, more Minecraft stuff. Anyway. Yep, that's the big plan is to be more part of DMG now that I have basically a beast of a computer right now. Mm, get that girl power out there. And Fuck yeah. this next person has the most the most infectious laugh I have ever heard. And I've heard some infectious laughs. Like, I've gotten sick of people's laughs. That's how infectious they are. But this, this man's laugh is like, is like a, a cool breeze on a hot summer day. This man's laugh is like rain in the desert. His content's pretty okay. But <laughs> allow me to introduce the one the only and give a big gum gum round of applause to Strahd Hat Axion. Hi Straw Hat, how are you buddy? Good to see you guys. Thank you so much. I'm fantastic. How are you all? <laughs> Just kidding, I don't care. <laughs> oh my god. So you streamed twice for you you, you were out here for, for DMG twice this year. Um, and how was that? How was Hold Down the Fort for, for DMG? Did, did you have a good time? I had an amazing time. It was, uh, it was really funny. Um, I, unfortunately, with the whole like house debacle, having to be cooped up in one of the smallest rooms of our house, it was 
let me say <laughs> my fiance three cats and myself and my pc was hot as shit in that room oh uh, my god but it was a good time um it, getting out of my shell of playing a scary game i'm not like layered here i can't i can't like just be passively eaten alive uh, unless it's <laughs> on a tuesday night if you know what i'm saying oh my <laughs> no it's been a lot of fun i've been enjoying it oh my gosh and let me just say i am so happy that i think uh you found my stream or i found yours something like that and i'm so glad you have um i feel like that's how it went i found you playing overwatch or you overwatch was involved at some point yes like, overwatch was involved <laughs> salty swearing and obscenities brought us together what? Wouldn't have it any other way. Absolutely. And but from the bottom of my heart and from the bottom of DMG's heart, I am so thankful to have every single one of you here tonight and to have every single one of you in our lives. So a big round of applause for you guys. And also a big round of applause for our audience. Oh my goodness, look how cute you guys look. Did you lose weight? Oh, I could see it. I could see it in your face. I could see it a lot. It looks great. So here's one more round of applause for you guys. And with that being said, we're going to get into the the, the the heart of Halloween, where I think everyone has had one or two good Halloween experiences. And chat, feel free to type them up and put them in the, uh, the chat and send them in. But I would just like you, I asked you to take some time and think on any positive Halloween experiences that you've ever had uh, from your childhood, uh, from your kids, ch from your raising your kids through Halloween, uh, anything that you can think of that makes you feel all warm and fuzzy. One thing for me uh, was that in high school, I always played Luigi's Mansion and watched Shaun of the Dead on Halloween. It was every single year for at least eight years, and then I remember, then I got tired of all that shit because of burnout. But um, Laird, do you have any positive? I know you said you didn't but you've had some time to think about it. Um, any positive or happy memories of Halloween from your childhood or in general? Uh, well, I, I'm, I'm old, so I forget my childhood. <laughs> well, it doesn't have to be from your childhood, just um, but, in your life. <laughs> well, yeah, probably, probably my best Halloween experience was um, meeting DMG in 2020. Meeting DMG in 2020? Yeah, when I, I was doing my, my Halloween streamer, um resident evil 7 just a nobody streamer uh with like three viewers and then all of a sudden carnage comes in with an unknown raid never met the guy in my life and he was playing the game and he had a his stream was coming to an end so he decided to have a little peek to see who was streaming and picked me from the list of hundreds of folk that were also playing resident evil 7 and that was that was the moment. That was that was when I became DM, DMG. Uh, so that that's my best Halloween experience, I would say. Like that, I loved it. What an amazing! I I'm like about to start crying. Not gonna lie, that's like the fact that Laird, you do you do you know Laird how much we love you? <laughs> do you know? Because I I have a strong feeling that you don't. <laughs> I'm not gonna tell I, you because that's not my job. But I, we love I, you a lot. I <laughs> I just, I just like to have friends. I, I don't need to be loved. <laughs> I'm gonna talk to you about the the the, the, the in depth more on that later with you privately, but <laughs> you're you're very much loved, Laird, and we are very glad to have you as our friend. Fraggle, yeah. do you have any? Yeah. Do you have any fond I memories do. of Halloween? I have quite a few. I'd say the most memorable one, one of my oldest friends that I met when I was about, it was sixth grade, so like 10, 11 years old. She mm -hmm. has very mild CP, cerebral palsy, which affects her gait and her walking. Uh, and she also grew up with, you know, separated parents. So single mom, food stamps, Debbie dad, the whole As day. rough of a situation as you could imagine for a child. Right. So she didn't really do a whole lot Halloween wise in terms of like going out in the neighborhood and her mom was pretty protective, afraid of her falling. And somehow I convinced her, you know, through being her friend to let us go out pillowcases, you know, just Oh, the whole nine yards. And cold. Yep. Just out in the world. <laughs> and we had a blast. It started snowing at one point. 
And we just got to be, you know, kids out there just running the muck in the neighborhood, staying out way too late. People annoyed at us because they're like, lights are turning off. Halloween's over. <laughs> we're still ringing doorbells. <laughs> we're like, we're going to fill these pillowcases. <laughs> and she had a blast and it was great. Aw, you, you, yeah. you, you got the mom to, to get your friend out of her shell. I love that. Yeah. I love yep. that. That's wholesome. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give that another. <laughs> Shy, my darling. Hun, you got, got any fun Halloween stories or any big um, plans for your baby boy for Halloween? So to come? for Halloween, I kind of like skimped on him this year because he's getting so big so fast. I didn't want to go out and buy a costume he wear maybe like once and then throw it away. So we just did a construction theme because he has a Mickey Mouse tool belt and mm -hmm. we let him go around with his dad wearing his tool belt. So it's just kind of a Aww. little family thing. But, little um, Harley the Builder. Yeah, exactly. But um, I don't have a lot of childhood memories. Um, Not a lot of people know this. I have a dent in my skull. Mm. Um, my dad's previous, one of his previous ex-wife, uh, gave me basically brain damage <laughs> to a Damn. point of, I don't remember a lot of, I don't really remember a lot of my childhood. Well, do you so, have any uh, Halloween memories from recent times? Any fun parties that you went to? No. No. I don't really nothing. go to, I don't really go to parties. Um, I guess like one good memory I kind of remember is I took my son to a friend of ours house to go trick-or-treating and when he was a little newborn baby <laughs> and um he met santa oh. and it really made me happy he met so santa little. while trick-or-treating <laughs> yeah there's this house they literally instead of decorating for halloween they just was like you know what go to christmas balls to the walls him and his wife was dressed up as mr and mrs claus and the exterior of the house was like the north pole and i was like fuck yeah i'm down for it I, I'm Santa not... photo with me. I, I, wait, wait, you, you they, they let you take pictures with Santa Claus on Halloween? Yeah. Not for nothing, but that is the time to take pictures with Santa because forget waiting in those lines. I'm not a huge Christmas person, but I see the lines with all those snotty kids. Hell yeah, yeah I will take a picture of Santa Claus on Halloween. And it was for free too. Um, my in laws Absolutely. took him last year for Santa photos. Yeah at the mall and it cost him like 50 something dollars and i go are you out of your freaking mind just dress grandpa up as santa yeah he won't know <laughs> but thank you shy for sharing that amazing yeah. story love you so much and straw hat axiom what yeah. is your f halloween memory for the class well I don't think I've ever met Santa um, on Halloween. That's pretty badass, honestly. Uh, that's like taking it to a whole nother level. Uh, you've heard of uh, Nightmare Before Christmas, but goddamn. Thank you. Um, <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll be here all week. Um, uh, I also don't necessarily remember a whole lot of my like childhood, not necessarily because I have a dent in my skull. Um, that's pretty hardcore, dude. Um, but... Uh, I moved a lot, a, a military family, so like I think my brain just kind of suppresses some of the like random bullshit. Um, but from like my mom got remarried and uh, she was in the Marine Corps for 21 years and she was like a six foot blonde bitch. Um, so everybody called her uh, Big Bird. She fucking hated it. She hated it. Well, when my brother was born um, and he was like kind of old enough to finally go trick or treating, she she embraced it. And she dressed this bitch dressed up as Big Bird, and there's a picture that circulates Facebook sometimes of her like, my brother's in a like a, a not a stroller, a, like a cart, and she's pulling him along, but she's like had stopped during Halloween trick or treating, and she was like had a cigarette in her mouth, dressed up as Big Bird, pouring herself a drink, and I, like just getting ready to go on her way, dude. Fucking epic absurd, mom man. shit. I, I I'm absurd. gonna take this kid trick or treating, but I'm still gonna party. Watch I feel me. like that's the real <laughs> nature of Big Bird. Big Bird after he's done filming, just, just a smoking fucking scotch. Dude. <laughs> oh hey there, kids! Do you know how to do basic math? I hate kids. <sighs> you know, I could have been a Muppet. <laughs> they get paid more, I'm sure. <laughs> well, it's, 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 it's the same. It's it's actually the Jim Henson made both, but. 
Um, anyway, thank you for that awesome story, that awesome visual. Thank you everyone for sharing and thank you for being here. Now, the time to get to the torture and pain of this game show. Not too good, bitch. That's right, that's right. It's not too good, bitch. Let's get over to the game. Whoop. Oh, yeah, that's that's that because I was looking at chat over there. Um, hold on. I I have a I have a thought. Um, pop out chat. There we go. Look at I'm smart. Never was a smart man. I mean, if you want a challenge, I, it's legal in California, so I am not against it. Oh, go for it. I have to be a little bit more incognito. Mm hmm. I have two more hours till I can challenge. Okay. So, normally, on the game show, I will assign every single one of you a partner. But I wanted to change things up this go around. It is a 4v4. No teams. Every Shit. person for <laughs> themselves. Get wrecked, fuckers. Get friggin' wrecked. <laughs> okay, I'm ready. All right. I'm gonna get steamrolled. <laughs> I'm thinking of a number between <laughs> one and ten. Seven. Shit. Two. Four. Six. Who said seven? Hey, fuck! I was gonna <laughs> say seven. Laird. Okay. Yep. So. From to 1 recount. to 100 to 500, so 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, five, cate five um, sections, and we have five categories. The five categories are trick or treat, which is basically truth or dare, or uh, truth or dare, uh, true or false, sort the date, yep. improv hell, devil in the details, and find the opposite. So, Shuck it, Trebek. <laughs> Shuck it, Trebek. So which, which category would you like to go first? Trick or treat? And I would like to ask that if you have the stream open, please close the chat. So that we do not um, have any accidental spoilers. Forgot to say that. Good job, chat. Thanks for reminding me. Y'all sexy. Arrgh. Oh, 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 and I'm sorry. But I forgot, in order to play this game, you have to sell a little bit of your soul. So. Too late. No. You have to find mine first. I lost it. It's a, don't worry. Don't worry. Laird, in yes. that Discord chat, please go ahead and read this aloud. The, 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 the post I just put in there. In, 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 which, in which chat? In the group chat. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. Dark Mode Gaming is a community for creators and consumers alike. Be out here for DMG and follow the stream. Thank you, Laird, for selling a little bit of your soul for me. <laughs> Moving on. Which category would you like? Street, trick or treat, uh, sort the date, improv hell, devil in the details, or find the opposite. Trick or treat, please, I think. Trick or treat for 100, 200, 300, 400, or 500 points. 100, because I'm stupid. 100, because you're stupid. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Recover. The day before Halloween is also known as Satan's Night. Is that a trick or a treat? Is that true or false? Uh, trick is false, treat is true. If you want to play along. Treat. It's a treat? I think so. That is incorrect. It is known as Devil's Night. Devil's <sighs> Night. Close, but no cigar. No candy for you on that one. All righty. Now we're just going to pick randomly. We're going to do 
Fraggle. Oh, we're we're gonna we're, we're let's just I guess we're, let's just go with the order that we have here. Fraggle. Let's see. Um. Go ahead, pick a category. And we're going bigger. We're going home. We're going improv hell. Improv hell for how much? For five hundred. For five hundred. Okay, now I need you to pick a contestant, uh, another contestant Ooh. to go against. Straw hat. Let's freaking go. <laughs> Straw hat versus Fraggle. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ready? Mm -hmm. Look. I was not gonna pick any of the improvs. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Shit. You're welcome. Choosing player is using a Ouija board to summon, then make a pact with a demon played by the other contestant, who is very nervous for this is the first deal with a mortal for their soul. Choosing player, Fraggle, must summon the demon and get as much out of the nervous demon as they can, while the demon finds their courage and steals this poor sap soul. Now, here's the thing. For the other contestants that are not participating, Laird and Shy, you will be able to give half points to your favorite player of this round. What it is rated on is how well they stick to the script, the, the, the narrative, how well they embrace and embody their character, and how entertaining they are. They, you could give them a 10 in entertainment and a zero for anything else, and that can be just fine. Um, but they will get half points for this, so Fraggle has a chance to win Technically a thousand if all points go to her. Double jeopardy, I'm ready. Basically double jeopardy, and that is how it goes for all of the improv. So ding, ding, ding. Oh, fuck, dude. <laughs> um, so I'm the demon. I'm a, am I reading this correctly? Yes. You're all nervous. Right. I'm extremely I wasn't gonna pick any of these. Don't be nervous. Uh, <laughs> boop. It's fitting. Boop. Just spit first, please. <sighs> oh. oh yeah. Okay. <laughs> Shit. Um, transform. All right, let's fucking go. Come on. Okay. How old are you, demon? This fucking thing. There's no one else using this thing with me. Hey, demon. <laughs> I uh, yeah. I need something from you. Are you there? Hello? Please, please don't yell at me. Okay, listen. You and I right now. Look at me, look at me right here, okay? I want to be rich. I don't care about being famous, but I want the easy life. I don't care what it costs. How are you gonna make this work for me? Don't you think I want the same thing? No, 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 look, you are all powerful. This is not Aladdin here, right? Like, you're, it's not three wishes. I get what I want out of you, all right? You're never, you're supposed to be this big baddie. I've never been told I've been all powerful before. Maybe we can work something out. Look, 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 sit down. I know this is your first time, right? You I'm just sitting. You be nervous, all right, all right? Do you want you me to sit on the floor? You can have whatever you want from me. Well, now we're talking. Oh, I like it when you sit on the floor, yeah. This makes <laughs> me feel different. Ooh, getting hot. <laughs> okay, we're gonna end there. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Jesus. That was not what I was expecting. <laughs> I, I went, we, we went about a minute and a half there. Uh, that was great. <laughs> Please don't yell at me. <laughs> Please don't yell at me. Oh, my God. This, that's fucking great. So. Shit, I need more booze. You're blushing. <laughs> I like how Shy is just mortified. <laughs> I'm not even mortified. I just wanted to see it continue to play out and how far it was gonna go. I was like... totally expecting it to go much longer than that. Mostly Are we like, to, like my sex life. Get under oh the table God. action now. Like... <laughs> What's next? Thank you, Lulu. Appreciate it. <laughs> I barely heard it, <laughs> but I heard it. Oh my God! So let's start with the peanut gallery. Shy, you appear to be the most flabbergasted. So, what do you think, hun? Who gets your points based on how well they embodied the role, how well they stuck to the narrative, and how entertaining they were? I have to say, straw hat. Straw because hat. You can see, 
you can see more action. No offense, Fraggle, but just you see more action that goes along with the story, so it's kind of setting it up nicely for the improv. Well, knocking a VR tuber for not using a camera. Okay, but <laughs> I'm, I'm... oh, your face. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Well, Laird, my friend. Yes. Yes. How did you feel about that performance and who gets your points? Uh, that was amazing. And as amazing as Fraggle wow. was, I think I give my point to Straw Hat as well. Uh, I, I've not seen a fright, I've, I've not seen a frightened demon performance like that since um, Supernatural. Super <laughs> oh. <laughs> Crowley. <laughs> that was pretty good. Now, this is interesting because I think Fraggle took a lot of initiative there. She Fraggle played did great, yeah. Oh, yeah. She, actually she, told me, she told me what to do with the sternness. And yeah, I and did she, it. She, she, she was even, you know, like. At one point, like she was like, me. "Listen, bitch," <laughs> and then she was like, "Oh, this is this is this demon's first time. I can't be that mean. Come, come on, we can work it out. Tell, she, tell she me what you some, need, baby girl." <laughs> she threw some compliments in there to make me feel a little reassured. That really struck a chord with me. And it, and and it, 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 I was gonna say she boosted your confidence. You're like, you know what? I am a good demon. Uh -huh. I was about to like, I was about to do some shit for her, but. She was a good boy. And she <laughs> said, sit, 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 on the, sit on the floor. Oh, I kind of like this. And I was like, all right, well, got my internet for the day. <laughs> so it is a dead tie between Straw Hat and Fraggle yeah, yeah. because the peanut gallery gave both half points to Straw Hat and I gave my points to Fraggle. We, it is anyone's game so far. So with that being said, Straw Hat, you are next. Ooh, let's do it to it. So we have trick or treat, sort the date, improv hell, the devil in the details, and everyone's favorite, find the opposite. I'm gonna go with uh, devil in the details for 300, please. How many circles of hell are there in Dante's Inferno? Is it uh, A, eight, B, nine, C, 10, or D, Dante didn't go to hell. He wasn't even supposed to be there today. Um, I'm gonna go with, <laughs> I'm gonna go with uh, B for nine, please. B for nine? Much like assist, it's benign. In Dante's Inferno, there are nine circles of hell. Limbo, lust, gluttony, greed, wrath, hearsay, violence, fraud, and treachery. Congratulations, 300 points to Straw Hat. Leading Limbo with 800. Sorry. Fraggle close behind with five. Shy and Laird, not on the board yet. Speaking of on the board, Shy Hun, you're up next. Trick or treat, sort the date, improv hell, devil in the details, or find the opposites. Uh, yeah, yeah. Trick or treat? Trick or treat for how many? 200, uh, 300, 400, or 500? 500. 500 going big or going home considering we're all on discord that's not very far in 2021 consumers spent 10.14 billion on halloween related things last year we spent out a national deficit worth of halloween crap is that true or false is that a trick or or a treat oh. Is that you said that was just for decorations? Halloween things in general. I'm gonna go with false. False. So as you're saying that ten point one four billion is a trick, that is actually a treat. Ten over ten billion in sales 
for Halloween crap. Congratulations, us, the world. Yeah, that's a lot of crap. That, that, that's, that's a lot of shit, man. It's a lot. But no points for you right now. Went big, but you took a big 500 point off the board, which is also kind of smart. Smart playing. But on to the next. Bringing all the way back around to our man in Scotland, Laird. You're up next. Trick or treat, sort the date, improv, hell, devil in the details, or find the opposite. Find the opposite. Please. Find the opposite for one, two, three, four, or 500. 500 for 500 going big or going home that's how dmg do god's big enemy so you must find the opposite of god's big enemy each word has an opposite so god's has an opposite big has an opposite and enemy has an opposite to find a specific phrase um devil's small friend Devil's small friend. I'm gonna give you three guesses for this, and I cannot check Discord because I can't find my phone. So if anyone messaged me, you're fucked. <laughs> so, uh, Devil's small friend is incorrect. Two mm. more guesses. Satan's small friend. Satan's small friend, that is closer. You have one word correct. Remind me again what the, what the original saying was. God's big enemy. Satan's small ally. Satan's small ally is not correct, but it sounds like a fun World War II movie. <laughs> Satan's little helper is correct. Oh, and I'll, I'll, I'll give the, the points to Rox, Ro, Ro, Roxy Sarah. Roxy Sarah is on the board for 500. <laughs> oh, um, and ask, ask Roxy Sarah to bring me some beer and port. She, you could actually do it. You actually just kind of did it. She can hear you. You could, you, you could just shout. I need some beer and port, please. <laughs> no I points on the board for Lerner. Hardcore, bro. Mm. Dude, I know. Um, okay. Oh. oh, shit. Sorry. I forgot to do this. Boop. There we go. Sorry, everyone. Um, let me... Now that we have that out of the way, we can move them down here. Yeah, there we go. For now. Okay. That's true. Oh. <laughs> you didn't see that. Fraggle. <laughs> You're up next, hon. Um, 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 let's do trick or treat for 300. Trick or treat for 300. Going with the easy categories. No, you didn't, Bryce Gar. Don't lie. So is this a trick or a treat? The 2004 Hellboy film, the first Ron Perlman one, featured various villains and terrifying creatures, undying demigods, tooth fairies, and undying clockwork Nazis. Oh Is my that God, true I've seen this too. or false? Nazis. Hmm. I'm going to say trick. Why is it a trick? Because I don't remember the movie that well, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, a, a guess is as good as, a, as it gets because it's false. The tooth fairies were oh, in God. the second film. Oh. You didn't, you, they didn't there show up in the first film? one. film? <laughs> yeah, there was a second one. I love Ron Perlman, though. Oh, He's shit. great. He's just an all-around fucking banger. All right. Who's next? Straw Hat. It's tied between Fraggle and Straw Hat. Sheesh. Straw Hat, you're up next. I'm going to do find the opposite for 400, please. 
Find the opposite for 400. That isn't Christmas. <laughs> what? That isn't Christmas. Find the opposite of that isn't Christmas. This is Halloween. Oh, this is Halloween. This is Halloween. Pumpkin shriek in the dead of night. Absolutely fucking correct. Straw hat pulls ahead. Ooh. Up next is Shy, the TP. Shy, <laughs> trash panda. How are you, hun? How are you hanging in there? Good. You, just you're a little bit behind to... right now. I want to see you get into these next couple right, okay? Okay. All right, so what do you want to do? Do you want to do trick or treat, sort the date, improv hell, devil in the details, find the opposite? Uh, uh can we do find the opposite for 100? Find the opposite for 100, going safe, trying to get on the board. Tunneling wizard. You tell him, Harley. <laughs> I'm so sorry. No, Harley, you best not be cheating. Are you cheating? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> totally. He admits it. <laughs> Disqualified. <laughs> the only thing that's coming to my mind for some reason is Harry Potter, but I know that's not correct. So each word has an opposite. Each right. one. I'm aware of that. I just. So what's the opposite the of a opposite. wizard? A human. What's the opposite of tunneling? If you're digging in the ground, what's the opposite of that? Like filling in. Yeah. Oh. So, filling in human would be your opposite of tunneling wizard? That makes me think of like human centipede for some reason. Okay, but that we're we're playing a game show though. <laughs> I know. I know. <laughs> oh my god, I I want to. I still want to say Harry Potter, but I don't know why. Okay, well, Harry Potter is is answer one. It is not correct, bro. I don't fucking know. It's the opposite of tunneling wizard. Jugs is very close, but are are you are you throwing in? Are 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 you throwing in the towel? Are are you done? Are are you? Are you... Yeah, I don't. I'm not aware of what that is. Flying witch, opposite of wizard is witch, witches and wizards. Boom! Runa gets the points. Wow, I didn't know that one. Witch, you 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 can exclaim your 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 disgust with me audibly, Straw Hat. You don't have to say it in chat. <laughs> Oh, How is flying Witch? the opposite of tunneling? <laughs> because I mean, I if you're going in the ground, flying part right me, away. Right? But like, I could not figure out wizard. I'm like, mm. yeah, oh, I like... couldn't figure out the first part. Crash, <laughs> we all float <laughs> down like... here, Georgie. But oh, God. opposite <laughs> of a wizard is a muggle because they don't have magic powers. But that's just. But you said I mean, Harry Potter. Very, that would a muggle would have been a better option. Harry Potter. <laughs> <laughs> Instead of saying a wizard's name. <laughs> Okay, no points, but that is the fun of Find the Opposite. That's why I said it's everyone's favorite, because it just sucks. Boy, this is category, actually really right. good category. Like, this could be its own game itself. It is. Right? This is the game show. You you thought this was going to be fun? No. <laughs> You're wrong. Too late. I'm enjoying it already. Ugh. Yeah, you, you, you can't think like the opposites. You have to think how I think the opposites work. Exactly, Blaze. Yeah. Exactly. Hold on, let me just get into Lulu's brain real quick. No, get out. You don't want to be in there. <laughs> yeah, it's full of, like, weird porn. It's full of just smut. <laughs> smut. Laird, you're up next, buddy. How's your port, okay. by the way? Is it tasty? It's very nice. Uh, th this is my own special combination. Ooh. Oh. I, I, I call this port 64. Are you going to bomb it in there, dude? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, You're just an Irish car bomb. I, I, I done that once and it didn't end well, so I don't do it anymore. <laughs> I learned that day. <laughs> I, I, 
I, I just have a port chaser now. Give me once. It's like motor oil. Christ, that's, that's thick. <laughs> that's a thick boy right there. <laughs> Real trashed on a port wine once when I was younger and never goddamn again. <laughs> Oh my gosh. All right, we 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 can't. We can't get this going. We we need to we need to do something. Hold on. I'm fucking Move everything on. up. Uh hello is that Discord. There you are. My Ooh. face hurts. <laughs> Good cuz it's killing me. Ha. Huh? <laughs> waiting for that. Put him. There, I got you back. There we go. We're even. The, oh, the Princess Diana. Why? Because as soon as you drink it, you're going to crash hard. Oh. <laughs> Terrible. Too mean? Damn. That's the too, line? Too soon? <laughs> too, soon? <laughs> too soon? Why? The Queen and Di are fighting right now, like like, like American Gladiators. <laughs> this is Princess Diana's moment of redemption. Do you not realize that? <clears throat> She's up there, like, full-on fighting her right now. Just like, you like motherfucker. Like Floyd and Tyson. Man, She's man. been yeah. up there longer. I bet you she has better real estate, dude. <laughs> First she she, 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 she has a longer out. foot. She has a bigger foothold in the in the economy. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> Laird, uh, tr trick or treat, sort the date, improv hell, devil in the details, or find the opposite. And um, sort the date, please. Sort the date for 100, 200, 3, 4, or 500. 500. 500 sort the date, trying to get on the board in a big way, did the Hocus Pocus film, made by Disney, come out in A, 1990, B, 1991, C, 1992, or D, with a little bit of protein, 1993. D, 1993. D, 1993 is correct. Ding, 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 ding! Dude, On the board! <laughs> Everyone going after that D when it comes to the 500 points. Okay. Congratulations on getting on the board. Fraggle! Let's do Devil in the Details for 500. Devil in the Details for 500. This will be the last 500 question. How many books are there? In the Satanic Bible, A, one, B, four, C, eight, or D, twelve. First of all, news to me. Uh, <laughs> A, no one, B, um, 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 four, um. C, eight. I'm just going to say D12. A1 because I didn't even know there would be multiple books for. I didn't even know there were. Anyway. A1. A1, final answer. Sauce. You don't want it. There are four books in the Satanic oh. Bible. B, four. One of each of Satan's, um, like, lieutenants or whatever. Oh. Yeah. Fun I fact, learned I today. You know. I know you learned today. <laughs> the horse Satan man? lives in your soul and likes force. Um,. Yeah. Uh, I guess <laughs> Straw Hat with a commanding lead What you gonna do next? Trick or treat, start the date, improv hell, devil the details, or Find the opposite Do trick or treat for 400 please Trick or treat for 400 In 2022, the most, this year, the most popular costume sold was Batman, is that a trick or a treat? I am going to go with trick. Trick! Spider-Man is the most sold costume in 2022. Approximately 2.2 million sold. Wow. Yeah, so if you go out in a boot for this Halloween, look, count, just count out how many spider kids there are. Does it include sexy Batman? No, not unfortunately. I mean, most Tom of their custom pretty, pretty fucking awesome. I don't blame. That it. was four hundred, right? Yeah. Boop. Commanding lead. Shy chance to get on the board. What do you pick, hon? Trick or treat. Sort the date. Improv hell. Devil in the details. Or. Oh. 
I meant to do something fun, but I ended up smacking my microphone. So I'm just going to move on. Find the opposite. Bong. I was going to do this. Um, can I do... I really don't want to. Uh, improv Hell for 400. Improv Hell for 400. And who is your opponent going to be? Laird. Laird is going to be your opponent. Some big points on the chance. Big points on the potential big points on the board to be grabbed by either Shy or Laird. Your prompt is... Lulu has become a zombie. Choosing player, Shy... And the other contestant must decide what to do with her. <gasps> oh my goodness. The other contestant is dead set on killing me. Laird, you want to blow my brains out. But Shy is saying no. You want to put my shuffling corpse to better use. We can't just get rid of Lulu. We need her. She's been with us for so long. <laughs> That bitch. <laughs> How can you say that about her? She's been here and helpful. She's been part of everything we've been through, and you can't even dignify her by letting her help us somehow. She's been too. She's been here too long. She's sat her time. She's sat her moment. We just can't get rid of her. We can use her for something. We can. We could probably use her to make her power the generator. We just can't let her go. I can't uh, let her go. She needs to go. We need to get rid of her. We, we, we need to fill that space with someone useful like Beer. How is Beer more useful than a person that can help generate electricity for us? Because it gets me fucked up. <laughs> That's not a viable reason. Yeah, but I know. But I, I need my beer. Get rid I of Lulu. Stuff. <laughs> oh my god! I don't that even. That's amazing. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm dying. <laughs> oh my god! That was everything I wanted and more. Oh my god! From the peanut gallery. Oh my god, Shy. I'm sorry. Uh, Fraggle. Woo. I'm, I'm delirious. <laughs> that was oh. fantastic. I'm so torn. I know. Because the, the initial, like, <laughs> fuck, fuck that. that. <laughs> fuck that bitch. <laughs> but then, um, I have to give it to Shy because I lost it when wow. you were just like, she, she generates electricity. And I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> I mean, physical movement on a giant hamster wheel could. That's all generate. I thought of. <laughs> yeah. Just, just dangle a dead body part in front of her. Like... Yeah. <laughs> I mean, to me, that's shit. a very sensible reason to keep a zombie around. Yeah. They don't stop moving. I, I gave her a very difficult task of, of keeping me around for whatever reason. And the obvious reason is to just to, 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 to get rid of me, but oh my Noble gosh. Noble energy. <laughs> Fuck windmills. Zombies. <laughs> on hamster wheels. <laughs> Straw hat, who, who's your points going to, fam? Oh, dude, are we allowed to give half and half? Did you say that? Uh, or am I making that up? You, do you want to give half and half? Yeah, because honestly... Oh, wait, I, I want I, half and half. Go back. I, I didn't I, know I, that. I the emotion <laughs> from both of them. Like... Fuck that bitch. I get that. I, I I felt that deeply. And then like That was probably my favorite part. <laughs> electricity? Like, man, I honestly beer might have hit me a little bit deeper. It's really hard. Beer Lulu. Mm, I'm gonna go half and half. Okay. <laughs> I, I, okay. If that's so, not allowed. Yeah, no, fuck I'm it. Go, it doesn't I'm, matter. The, the points right. don't matter. <laughs> It's whose line now? <laughs> it's always been whose line. It's just, it's just me oh, making you guys it. answer really annoying questions. <laughs> Great. Okay, Shy is on the board with three hundred. Laird's on the board with six hundred. I gotta give I gotta give points to Laird because he just said fuck that bitch. It's just like fuck that bitch. I, I respect that. I, and Shy, I want to give you points because that's pretty in ingenious. Like that's. That's pretty. I don't even know how to say it. 
um, but like inventive. Like Michonne put zombies on the leash and like so she could blend in and stuff. But that you're yeah. just like, no, 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 no. Watch, we can, we don't have to work for it. We can make the the the, the problem work for us. My thing is, is I went with like innovative because you can't just kill everybody. At some point, you're going to run out of resources to continue to do that. So you may as well make it livable for yourself until then. Oh, amazingly said. Um, shit. I don't know how to do this. Let me... I like what Coffee Crazy said. What if the zombie gets beer? You could use zombies to roam between bases. I don't know what Jug says. Zombie, zombie pro prostitute hunt? <laughs> I mean, that wouldn't be the worst use of my body. Oh God! <laughs> what, Fraggle? Come on, you you know me, but I don't think you've ever been on a stream with me where I'm in charge. <laughs> to be honest, I mean, it seems like a legitimate thing, though. All right. I mean, it's I'm a prostitute? moving pussy or ass, however you want to look at it. I mean, but All of the above. dead you can ass. Make your own holes at that point. Yeah. Oh God, yeah. that's horrible. <laughs> Let's see if this uploads. We have to sell and sell their soul, but we have we got enough. We can go one more while this uploads. Get out of my head. Um, ba -ba -ba show. There we go. All right, on to the next. Boop. There, now we can include it. See if that goes in. Whoo. Okay. Uh, that was. Wait, that was Shy's point. And, okay, so Laird, you are back up, my friend. There's Trick or Treat for 200, Sort the Date, Up to Four, Improv Hell, Devil in the Details, and Find the Opposite. Let's um, this down here. Sort the Date done me some good last time, so I'll go with Sort the Date 400, please. Sort the Date for 400. Let's see them numbers. Shaun of the Dead, some, uh, just around your neck of the woods there. A, 2000, B, 2004, C, 2006, or D, 2010? It's definitely A or B. Um, but which one is it? Shaun of the Dead. I'm trying to think. When, when did Sarah and I last, when did we first watch that? Well, it's probably either 2004 or 2000. I think it, I think it, I think, I think it came after Snatch. Uh, oh, was it? Oh, fuck. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Um, this is potentially an easy 400, and I think I'm about to blow it. Is it out in 200? Uh, 2004. 2004. 2004. Is that your final answer? Are you sure? Yes, because I don't remember hearing of having heard of it in 2000. Man. That's right! Shaun of the Dead was originally released in 2004. B, 2004. Congratulations. Con con From hanging out with no points, now right on Straw Hat's ass. But Fraggle has a chance to take a lead right here, right now. Oh, wait, maybe not. Well, if she gets the <laughs> improv hell and gets all the points, she may, in fact, take a lead. But I'm actually going to go. Go ahead. With devil in the details for 400. Devil in the details for 400 going for solid points. What is the title of the Futurama episode where Bender goes to hell? A, season one, episode nine, hell is other robots. B, season one, episode nine, robot hell. C, season one, episode nine, infernal machine. Or D, sold my software to the devil. You know, I've seen this too. Um... Bum 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 bum. I'm gonna take a wild stab and say D. D sold my software to the devil. That is incorrect. 
Oh, Wah. press the wrong button. The, the episode where Bender goes to hell is Hell is Other Robots. A, Ugh. Hell is Other Robots. The others, I made up. That's right. Hire <laughs> me to do your writing. No points for Fraggle. The better title. I know, right? It's pretty it good. Is a title. <laughs> um, so that's still doing. All right, we'll we'll wait one more. <clears throat> I just want to give a big round of applause to everyone so far. Y'all are doing fucking amazing. Very impressed with all. Just like all the other answers on this game show. <laughs> You're so funny, Carnage. You're so funny. Everyone follow Carnage. Ugh. No, I'm kidding. Um, no, don't follow him. His ego's big enough. Um, I was gonna say, Laird, when you were sitting there thinking and you did this and you were looking up, the for some reason your background and you doing that was just perfectly tied. <laughs> don't know why. It just looked very like, a, like a terrestrial godlike. It was funny. I just got a kick out of that. I am Laird, worship me. Um, all right, so since that's taking forever, give me one second. We need someone to sell their soul just a little bit. Um, and if I'm fucking up the cameras, let me know. All right. Straw Hat, since you are leading the pack, it is time for you to sell a little bit of your soul. Go ahead and give that a read. Dark Mode Gaming is a community for creators and consumers alike. Be out here for DMG and follow the stream. No, the one after, on, on, under that. The one I, I just posted. What? <laughs> what? I don't see anything. Mm, are you sure? Here, I'll, I'll DM it to you. Oh, not control M. There you go. Oh, is that it? Yeah, okay, that was it. It, it copied I, and pasted twice. The, I did not read the top part. I'm sorry. Like what you see, you'll love DMG. Click on that Discord link and be a part of the fun. Dark Mode Gaming is a community for creators and consumers alike. Be out here for DMG and follow the stream. Did I do it right? Yeah, you did it right. Thanks. <laughs> Woo! Uh, sorry, I didn't really think about the first part. Can you say dark mode gaming one more time? Good. Dark mode gaming? Yeah. I don't know why. I like the way you say it. Oh. Uh, yeah, me too. Dark mode gaming. <laughs> Dude, I got called out once on, on uh, Overwatch when I was streaming. I was like, hey guys, how are we doing today? And I said it. They were like, you sound like a YouTube streamer. And I just kind of looked at my camera and like, fuck. <laughs> Yay. Busted. <laughs> but you got that nice, robust voice. You, it's commanding. <laughs> like, like you grab, grab him by, by the hoo ha, and you're just like, let's go. We're, 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 we're gonna go on an adventure together. Come with me, and you'll be <laughs> be led around by your balls. Um, let's go to the game show. Who is up, Fraggle? You just went straw hat. You are back up, my friend. Oh, goodness. Trick or treat for 200. Short the date. Improv hell. Devil in the details. Find the opposite. Those are your categories. <laughs> I didn't put any pauses in between them. <laughs> Let's go with sort the date for 300, please. Sort the date for 300. Halloween. The original Halloween. Was it A, 1960? B, 1969, C, 1972, or D, 1978? It's, it, it's taking everything in my uh, childish little mind, not to say uh, 1969, <laughs> but I'm going to go with A, 1960. A, 1960 is incorrect. The, f the film Halloween was originally released in 1993. 90, I'm sorry, 1978. My brain shut off for, for a second. <laughs> just like, Pew. I misunderstood the question. Let's just go on. Yes, okay. <laughs> Were you My thinking God. of like the actual Halloween? I don't want to talk about it. Okay. <laughs> 
<laughs> That's what I was thinking. Just too. let's just go on. Yeah, the, I was like, when was the first Halloween? Like, when did they have a first <laughs> Halloween? That's why I said 1960. I can obviously know that them. Hey, thank you for that follow. I didn't see that. I didn't see who followed, but thank you so much. Shit. Um, Shit. Okay. Kind of a losing round. Kind of a losing round so far. Let's see if Shy can turn it around. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That 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 was just bad. <laughs> All right, Shy. What do you want? Trick or treat. Sort the date. Wow. Improv. Hell. Huh? Devil in the details. Or find the opposite. Improv. Hell. Improv. For hell. 300. For three hundred. Okay. Now you cannot pick the same opponent so you get to pick someone else now um straw hat why not straw hat versus shy for 300 going down. and a potential extra Probably. 300 points on the board the the prompt is and this is the one yes mm, you like it i love it batman shy Choosing player has broken into a manor that was recently purchased in Gotham. In a large room in the back, a coffin sits alone. The lid opens and Dracula, other contestant, rises from it and a dialogue of the bats begin. In their best Batman and Dracula voices, <laughs> Batman is at the ready to strike down the eternal vampiric nightmare, but Dracula's intentions are far more pure. He simply wants to go trick or treating. Batman must interrogate Dracula and see if Dracula is telling the truth. Go, have fun. <laughs> what are you doing in my house? I'm trying to scope out you the best that I possibly can. And for sure, you're the purest form of evil I have found. I would not disagree. At all, actually. I take that as a compliment. Yes, thank you. Considering would you like the fact to go that you've killed many of civilians, I don't really consider you a pure heart person in my book. That was the old me. I'm trying to uh, roll over a new leaf. Is that how you say it? You would you like to go trick-or-treating with me? How do I know this is not a point for you to try to kill me and suck out my blood and eat my heart? You just have to trust me. Yeah, I trust you as far as I can throw the Joker. You look pretty buff. I feel like you could throw him pretty far. He's a little scrawny. It doesn't matter. You killed countless of people and you should not be trusted. Okay. Curveball, curveball, <laughs> curveball. <laughs> Trick or treaters are now at Dracula's door. They they oh. ring the doorbell. Trick or treat! Oh, come with me, Mister. Um, who are you? I'm Batman. <laughs> <laughs> and we're done. <laughs> I'm Batman. <laughs> Holy shit, that was. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Oh, I, I wouldn't Batman, disagree. So I, can, I can't do it. I can't. I'm Batman. I'm Batman. I am Batman. I am Batman. Let's touch <laughs> The city just Batman. showed you. It's not afraid to stand up to criminals. <laughs> Where are my bat pants? Alfred! <laughs> Where is my bat red? Oh. Oh. <laughs> you want to know how Shy got those scars? She blew out her vocal cords. <laughs> oh my gosh. So from the peanut gallery, hippity hoppitus, what's going on with all of this? <laughs> I'm so stupid. <laughs> what did you think? I, I embarrassed myself. Um, Laird. What did you think of that? What did you think of that amazing display? It, that, that was amazing. I mean, Shai's Batman was 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 brilliant. But right? <laughs> you liar! <laughs> no, no, it was. It was. It was brilliant, Shai. But like, Straw Hat made me feel like I was in Transylvania. I, I also that, like that, I that Dracula that. accent. 
So I've who do your points go to? What my, we do in the shadows recently? Oh. <laughs> my points go to, go to Straw Hat. Wow. Straw Hat. Getting half points. 150. Thank you. Although I've just realized that was a stupid move. The, the, the um, strategic move would have been to give them a shy. <laughs> You're fucked. <laughs> Too late. <laughs> <Fuck>. <laughs> Frackle. <laughs> so much for fuck you. Fuck that bitch. <laughs> Fraggle. I'm so torn. Um, I don't want Straw Hat to win, so I want to just give all my points to to Shy just based on that. Even though <laughs> I giggled I really bad that. with the trick or treaters at the door, and you were like, ooh. <laughs> That got me. Um, can I split my points since you didn't let me last time? Uh, three hundred. Yeah. Yeah, seventy-five each. Um, yeah. no, nope. <laughs> because fuck you. That's why. <laughs> Make a choice, mm. damn it. No. This is torture. Um, <laughs> it's not um, supposed to be fun. <laughs> mm. I, Batman sounds a little uh testy. <laughs> I have to give it to Straw, though. <laughs> straw? Damn it, All Straw. Right. So, so that's, what, uh, 150 is three, uh, eight, no, 900, right? Yeah, 750 plus... Yeah, 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 plus 150, okay, yeah. Uh, I'm giving mine to Shy. She, uh, she, not only did she line up that I'm Batman perfectly, but I feel like she tried to do the voice as best she could. Right in the beginning, she was like, I, I, uh, I am growly. <laughs> it's hard. I can't get my voice to I enough. know. You got points. Don't complain. I, I appreciate <laughs> it. I feel bad that I can't do the voice well. Like, I can't do it justice. I will say, justice. though, I, I would like to give one bonus point to Straw Hat because the sort of effeminate Dracula. Oh my God. Who, who are you? And what are you doing in my blah? I was just like, oh, oh my. I like I this Dracula. <laughs> First thing came to mind. Okay, so Straw Hat with a firm lead, Laird, Close, somewhat close behind. Fraggle sort of sitting at 800 for a little bit now. And now Shy ramping it up to 600, getting right behind Fraggle. So far, it's anyone's game. Anything can happen because we still got another couple improvs and we still got a full, pretty much a half a board left. So let's go over here. Uh, yep. Yeah, pretty much, pretty much half a board. All right, the whole bottom half is gone. So we just did shy. So Laird, now's your chance, my friend. One hundreds, all the easy questions, pretty much. Yep. Some of them are kind of fucked, but that's for you to find out. <laughs> uh, I need all the points I can get at the minute. So can I have find the opposite for three hundred, please? Find the opposite for three hundred. Let's do it. Jill Q blindfold. Jill Q what? blindfold. What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> Jill Q blindfold, bitches. Not too good, bitch. Not too good, bitch. Jill Q blindfold. It's surprisingly easy. No looking at chat. What is the opposite of Jill Q blindfold? Runa, I think, knows what it is, but she's just like, I hate this. <laughs> no, coffee. It shouldn't. Because this is pain. This is find the opposite. You're not supposed to enjoy find the opposite. Let's, <laughs> la 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 let's hear some of your thought processes, Laird. We're, 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 work it out so everyone can hear it. Blindfold <laughs> is the only word that I can possibly see there is actually having an opposite because Jill, is that not a, that's like a name and Q is a fucking random letter. Like, <laughs> what the fuck? Um, hmm. So it's something unblindfolded. 
I've changed my mind. Uh, I, 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 I need a guess. Improv for, improv for 200. I, I need a guess. A single guess. Oh. Um, 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 um. Oh, fuck. I don't even know where to begin. Uh, um. Jack. Oh, fuck. Um, what, what could replace Q? Jack. Oh, I don't know. I've blown it. Keep thinking. Oh, keep thinking. I, I want to give it to you. I'm going to give you the extra Jack. minute. Uh, Jack. Jack. So it's obviously Jack and Jack. It's and all Q. Halloween Jack. themed. Jack. Q, 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 Q. What could replace Q? Blindfolded. Oh, man. I'm panicking. I'm buckling under the pressure. You have until 3.15 my time to get it. It's buckling. Buckle the pressure. Buckle me. Uh, Jack. Jack. Q. Q. Fuck. Um. Eh. No. Jack O. Lantern. Oh, motherfucker. <laughs> Jack O. Lantern. The opposite of Jack is Jill. The opposite of Q or is O doesn't really have anything. So I just put the little dangly on it because it's different. Um, and Lantern... It lights your way, so a blindfold blinds you. It, it, it hinders it. you. Yep. It's so much fun. <laughs> don't you want to be part of this game? <laughs> this that game. makes I no just... sense. <laughs> yeah, it's total it's sense. Fun. I just wish I'd gone for improv that time. Oh my goodness. Okay. Fraggle. Oh uh, yeah, Fraggle. Okay. Um, 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 I'm gonna regret it, but at this point, it's it's whatever. Oh, I'm gonna do find the opposite for two hundred. Ooh, getting find the opposite off the board. Because I figured that other one out that Laird couldn't like part way through, and I was like, damn, I wish <laughs> I could steal. <laughs> yes, uh, Blaze, that is the point of the game. It's supposed to make no sense whatsoever. Because the only sense that makes sense is nonsense, and that's the way it goes. Um, so you find the opposite for hallowed ground, Shaq. Ooh, okay. Uh, opposite of Shaq would be house. Hallowed ground. Uh, haunted house? No. Is are the word? Is it going to be three words? It's two Should words. I assume that. I'll, I'll give you words. that. It's two words. I'm going to say Haunted House. Haunted <laughs> House. It's wrong, but it's fine. <laughs> I'll give you two chances on this one. We're just going to go, okay. go screwy with the, um, with the one. So one of the words is correct. Oh, okay. Well, I assume the word is house. Okay. Um... <laughs> That's supposed to help me. <laughs> no. Nope. Um, supposed to distract um, you. Um. I didn't even have time to really give you the the distractions I really wanted to do, but that's gonna be for the <laughs> Christmas one. I didn't. We didn't have it in the budget. <laughs> uh, what's the opposite of hollowed ground? Hmm. Devil's house? I don't know. Someone in chat knows. <laughs> no, the answer is haunted mansion. The opposite of a shack oh, is a mansion. Damn it! Haunted was the word. Son of a bitch! I was so close. <clears throat> nope. <laughs> you picked, but no cigar. Should right. I me, I'd pull ahead of me? I'm a disgrace. I think chat is winning, <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> All right. I've got collective brains. <laughs> Straw hat. With 19,000 and one point. Go ahead and one. pick your next category. <clears throat> Trick right, or treat, really... sort the date, improv hell, or devil in the details. I need to redeem my high ass. I'm going to go sort the date for 200, please. Sort the date for 200 for my high ass. The Nightmare Before Christmas was originally released in A, 1990. B, 1989, C, 
Uh, I'm going to go with C93. C93 is correct. Pew, pew, pew. Let's go. Let's go. I Fucking. Like, fuck, we out you. Same. Mm -hmm. He can't be stopped. <laughs> Shy no. the TP. You're up on. Okay. Um, improv hell, 200. How about a little bit of Halloween chaos? These two, these right here, these three right here before you pick, I'll let you pick again, will be worth 600 points. First one to him gets him. What was your? Improv hell for 200. Improv hell for 600. Choosing player is an evil genius that has just finished creating a monster, and their assistant, the other contestant, is worried about the sound of angry villagers outside. Play by me. Choosing player is obsessed with his or her new creation and cannot hear what is occurring on the outside. They are instead focused on what to call their monster. Their assistant must do their damnedest to alert their master of the forecoming mob. And the points don't matter, as Blaze said. Yeah, pretty much. Ready? Set? Oh, who is your opponent? Fraggle. Oh, shit. Okay. Uh... I like that Shy has been... Has been taking charge with this improv thing. I, I do love it. Okay, Shy. Evil genius that has created a monster. Fraggle, your, your little spooky gat, cat ghost assistant. Angry mob outside, played by me. Shy can't hear what's going on. Too busy worried about naming this beautiful monster that is Laird. Um, just because you're just so handsome. Um, and... Fraggle must get her master's attention. Ready, set, go. Look at my beautiful creation. He's perfect. Master, master, please. Not right now. I'm enjoying master, my master. masterpiece. Outside the mini. Master, 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 please. You need to back off. Here. I need I, to I, find I, a I, name I, for my monster. He's perfect. Can you not enjoy the oh, perfect God. monster? I, but they're getting closer, Master. Listen, put them in. I don't care. We're an angry mob. They're, they're coming, Master. Please. I don't rabble, care. Rabble, Just rabble. close everything off and don't let them in here. My precious project here is coming to life, and he needs a name. It's more important than them assholes out there. Either you're going to help me here, or you can go out there to them. If it's me to name, we might as well just name it Lulu. I <laughs> will name it Clarice. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm going to stop you there. I'm going to stop you there. <laughs> Amazing work. Amazing work for 600 points from me and 300 from the peanut butter gallery. Where is it? Oh, I'm good. There it is. Boop. Peanut gallery. Straw hat. Laird. Thoughts, opinions, and points. Go. Laird, Laird go for it. That, that, that was a tough one. Um, both Shy and Fraggle pulled that out of the park. I mean, what the hell? Like, Shy, it was almost like she was reading from a script. It was amazing. And then... Fraggle was in there with the, True. like with with the with the, the voices and stuff. It's like, oh, it's a tough one. I, I would like to split my points if I'm allowed to. Split your points. I'll allow it. Fuck it. Yeah, I I, I would like to give half and half because both of them were fantastic. I don't think I could pick a favorite. Some fucking bullshit over me. here. Oh, you are so <laughs> fucking pure. This is some shit. Holy shit! I don't, I don't remember that. Okay. <laughs> Fraggle, you did fantastic, doll. I appreciate it. <laughs> no, you did great. <laughs> no, you did great. I'm there. That was funny. 
Hi, Larry. Like, we have to oh. name it. <laughs> you know, no, well, Fraggle gets the points. You don't get the points. Um, Straw Hat. Leader. Oh, shit. Big Salami. So, Not just talking um, about your position on the board. Hello. <laughs> All right, on that note. DM me later. Um, <clears throat> they were both fantastic. I really felt the energy from both of them, dog. Like, super crazy dog. The energy through the roof, bro. But I'm, I'm going to go with Fraggle. Because I, I, I love me some... I could feel the emotion, even though I can't see your face. Emotion. <laughs> <laughs> but seriously, I love the voice. It was, I could, it was, I could almost see the hunch in your back, dude. Like in the like fucking limp you had, I could see it. <laughs> Frag all the way. Man, I I hate to do this to you, shy, but Straw Hat made the exact point. I I I thought was a little bit superior. You, but Laird made this point about Shy's performance. Um. You had a script in your head, like, pre-written. You must have, because you knew exactly what to say at the exact right time. You're like, we're just going to call it Lulu. Ah, I was in <laughs> oh, theater no, for about, yeah. four years. <laughs> oh, so. well, shit. Well, then, I guess it's a little ironic that Fraggle gets the points. <laughs> uh, that's two for 600. Boop, boop. 1850. Bam. But you're still not out of the ranks yet. So, shy. Missed out on that. Laird, you're next. For these next two. These next. You know what? Fuck it. For these next five. One person. If they get it wrong, as soon as the person gets it wrong, they can say their name and steal. Say your own name and you can steal it if you know it. It's all cutthroat now. You thought you were friends. No, not, not here. Not in this hell. Speaking of hell, where the hell did he go? <laughs> Straw hat. <laughs> you get lost, buddy. We found him. Oh my god. Laird, trick he or treat. So trick or treat for 600, sort the date for one, improv for one, devil in the details for one or six. Um, trick or treat for 600, please. Trick or treat for 600. The Walking Dead originally aired October 31st, 2010. Um, hmm. 2010. What was I doing in 2010? Nothing exciting. I'm pretty boring. Hmm. Nonsense. Uh, I'm gonna say I'm gonna say trick, because I'm pretty certain we we moved back home to Falkirk in 2010. And I am pretty certain Sarah and I watched Walking Dead before we moved back. So I'm going to say trick. I think that's a trick. Trick? So you think it's a lie that on October 31st, 2010, The Walking Dead did not air? Or whatever. Yeah. It's whatever it equals to being a, a, a fallacy. Well, I guess since it's true or false, you can't really steal this one. So no. It's false. Or it's a treat. It's a true. What? Yeah, oh, it, what did. it did. It oh, did. First in October thirty first, two thousand ten. No points. Blair, motherfucker. Straw Hat oh, holds his firm, firm lead. Very firm. Hard. No. Um. Fraggle has a chance to now steal. Let's go back over here. I need hotkeys for this oh, shit. <clears throat> Devil in the details for six hundred. 100, improv hell for 100, or sort the date for 100. Mm. I'm going to do sort the date for 100. Sort the date for 100. Evil Dead, A, 1981, B, 1990, or C, 1975. Ooh. 
Um, Let me put that. I'm gonna say B nineteen ninety. B nineteen ninety is incorrect. Cheyenne oh, for the steal. Shy for the steal. A nineteen eighty one. A, 1981, is correct. Should have went with my gut. <laughs> I'm going to give you double points. You know what? I'm, I'm going I'm to give, give you 300. I said everyone can steal once. I know. I'm also, like, stoned. <laughs> do, do, I, do I, I think I should get some bonus points for being old and forgetting that I could have done that. <laughs> I'll give you... A half a point. I'll give, give you a you percentage. Yeah. A fraction. 1,400.5. Now the points really don't mean shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. Okay. Uh, now, Fraggle, right? I, I think, yeah. No. Or, or Lair? Straw hat? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Straw hat. <laughs> Tripping balls. I'm tripping balls. I'm, I'm, I need to be. I need to be on Axiom's level. Um, Challenge. And in, we got three more questions. Hold on. Jeez. It's, it's like you've never played a game show before. <laughs> Wait, I'm on a game show right now? Hi, Mom. <laughs> bitch. I'm going to go with a... Uh, Fucking I'm Big Bird, with... bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. I'm going to go with a... Uh, Devil in the details for 200, please. Devil in the details for 200. Let's equally steal. 600. But you can steal this one. Steal. Let's steal. Let's steal. Stealing yeah. it now. Hold your turn, dude. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> How much did The Devil's Advocate oh. featuring Tom Cruise and Al Pacino make in the box office in its entire run? Here's my mind. Don't want it. Never mind. <laughs> Is it A, 97 million, B, 103 million, C, C, 153 million, or D, 302 million? Pretty much on all the questions, I'm going to guess again. I'm going to go with C, 153 million. 153 million. Are you absolutely sure? This is for 600 points. Oh, like, this, is, this, is, this is going to stomp anyone that's left beneath you now, unless I, I pull some weird game show host thing where I just make the points not worth anything. Are you sure? Yes. Man. You're right. Is 153 Aww. fucking million. Aww. A lawyer Tom Cruise has a hellish encounter with his lawyer partner and mentor Al Pacino made 153 million in box office. Bam. It would be less than that. Fuck. <laughs> just like the ACTs, just just guess B or C. It's like usually a really good option. <laughs> well, straw hat one. Unless. We make it these a thousand points each and stealable. Fuck it. Wow. Bullshit. These are at a thousand. Of course it's bullshit. You think it? Derivative. Uh, if I, I don't think this one, if, if, if it's multiple choice, if it's true or false, you can't. But I'll make it worth a thousand if you get it right. So, shy. We'll make it 500 each. That's that's more fair. Um, I want to stick with the improv help because I feel like no one else wants to do it. <laughs> I, I, I gotta I gotta say that you have been killing this and I, I do appreciate that. Now, who is your opponent for this match? Um, let's see. I already did Fraggle. Axum was pre before her. So Laird, it's your turn again. Unless Lulu wants to play with me. Okay, then who would I be playing for? I don't know. Pinch hit, nice. 
Who do you want me to be playing for? Who do you want to get the points? Me? Besides Bobby? you. <laughs> oh, I guess Laird. Yeah. I like Laird? The <laughs> win win situation. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Like, who doesn't want I'll, the I'll play for Laird. Uh. <laughs> this is a good one. This is the first one I wrote, and I was very happy about it. Okay, so I'm pitch hitting for Laird. So, um, so Straw Hat, you will be giving away my points. You will be deciding who gets the extra points as the current holder. Okay, right. either Laird or Shy. Okay, choosing player Shy is a serial killer looking to enlist an employee at their local mortuary to help hide current and future bodies of victims. The mortuary employee isn't totally against this idea, me, but still feel morally skewed. The killer will do their best to convince the employee to help them. And then points for sticking to the narrative, entertaining, and how well they portray the character. That was supposed to be on all of them, but I fucked that up because I deleted all of my stuff because I didn't save it last night. Then I got upset, stayed up till three o'clock in the morning and finished half of it, finished half of it minutes before this stream started. Fun fact. Now, you're a serial killer. You're coming to me and be like, hey fam, I need help. And I'm be like, mm, maybe. Okay, you got the prompt, you ready? Go. You there, you there. Yeah. How much you yes. make currently at this facility? Uh, not too much. You know, I, uh, I, I, I just started, so there's no real, uh, you know, employee benefits and nothing. So, uh, I, you know, I, I could use some scratch. Why, you, so, you, you need some help or something? How about this? I'll make you an offer you can't resist. I'll pay you double. And benefits. If you come work for me. I do just you need have to dental? do a simple thing. Yeah, of course I got dental. Cool. cool. I just need you to do something for me and to continue to work for me as we continue on this journey. I mean, like, I don't got to, like, do any sex stuff, do I? Because, you know, I'm not against it, but, like, what, 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 what you hiring me for, huh? What you're going to do is get me a list of all the people that come in here, including their injuries and what else they find on the bodies. Give me oh, that list. You you want me to give you a list of dead people? Why do you want yeah. a list of dead people? We listen. One guy came know, over here earlier saying he want to do some weird stuff with a guy with the clown makeup. We said no. We I turned him said, away. Listen to me. If you want to earn double what you currently make now, you get me that list. What list? You you the think we just keep a list in. of dead bodies? Yeah, of course. Who else do you, comes in Do you here? play lots of video games? Because that's not the way it really works, hon. All right, then give me the list of everybody that came in that was recently killed by another person. Give me that oh, now. That's a pretty short list. Here, let me get that. All right, here you go. It's just one guy. Laird Forbes. Apparently stabbed in the neck. It's terrible. You should see it. The knife's still there. It's stuck. Give me that knife. That knife needs to come with me as well. Did you by chance kill that Laird Forbes fella? I'll give you an, an extra grand if you don't say anything. You did. You did kill that Laird Forbes fella. Why don't you make it two grand extra? How about I kill you next? One grand works fine. <laughs> <laughs> Scene. <laughs> Scene. <laughs> The last part, though, that was fantastic. <laughs> My face hurts. Holy shit. Okay, from the peanut gallery. Laird, how did I do? <laughs> you, yes. I guess. <laughs> Whose points are you going to give to? <laughs> are you going to give it to yourself? <laughs> I didn't think about this. <laughs> I, I am I'm actually in the process of ordering an Oscar for you right now from Amazon. Oh, thank amazing. you. <laughs> okay, I, mean, so I can never win against Lulu. She's way yeah. too good. 
All right. So, I guess we're giving... I guess Laird's giving points to himself because I didn't... No, no, no. Okay. So, your thoughts on that was great. But we're going to make Straw Hat... You know what? We're going to make Chat give half of the points. Chat decides who they give it to. Laird or Shy on... I played on his behalf. Fraggle, let's hear the highlights. What did what, you like about it? What didn't you like about it? Favorite parts? Who are you giving your points to? I don't think it's very fair, the voice acting part. Um, <laughs> so honestly, I'm not going to say shit on this one, but <laughs> I think Shy is so quick on her feet and kept mm -hmm. you on your toes. And that end bit was so good with the money and like the whole like well then you're next kind of thing with the knife that sold me so i personally as much as i love you lulu and i don't think it's fair i'm gonna give it to shy because she's a contestant and you're not <laughs> well you're giving the points to to oh, yeah it's fine it's fine the points don't mean anything <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Okay, Straw Hat, I saw you cracking up in the corner, <laughs> just dying over there. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> my face hurts so much from laughing all night, dude. That's why I'm dude. sitting here like, uh... dude, how high are you right now? Uh, yes. 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 <laughs> just working the jaw muscles. I'm also been drinking, so like, I'm, I'm nervous. You're doing great. It's, no, any, no it's, the, it's, it's, it's a day that ends in Y. I'm, yeah, it's all good. Yeah, of course. Uh, the only day you're not drunk is tomorrow, and once that becomes today, it's all fucked. <laughs> <laughs> all right. God damn it. Stop distracting me. Whew. All right. So, shit. I don't know. Split my points. I'm just kidding. Um, too, many, too many splits tonight. Um, Thank you. Thank you. It's... Buttons of steel. I really, really liked how aggressive Shy was. And she's losing, so Shy. <laughs> Final answer. I appreciate that. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so that gives that's that's nine fifty. Laird's seven uh no. Four, yes, yeah, seven. Definitely. Okay, boom. There it is. Crazy fucking board. Laird with 1,700 and 0.5 points. Fraggle with 1,850 points. Straw Hat with 2,701 points. Shy with 900, 1,950 points. Now for 500 each. Oh, wait. That was done. That was done. For this last one, devil in the details. Laird starting it off. Putting a nail in this proverbial coffin. When did the satanic panic start? The satanic panic is a moral panic consisting of over 12,000 unsubstantiated cases of satanic ritual abuse. When did it start? A. It's always been around. B, the 1960s, or C, 1980s. And this one's worth 500 points. So you won't win, no matter what. But you'll come in second, which isn't bad. Uh, could you repeat the question, please? When did the satanic panic start? The satanic panic is a moral panic consisting of over 12,000 unsubstantiated cases of satanic ritual abuse. See, that sounds like something modern day dummies would invent. So I'm going to go with the most recent date available. What were the dates again? It's always been around 1960s or 1980s. I suppose it's possibly either always been around, but then back in the olden days, people were a bit more sensible. So I'm going to say the 1980s. 1980s. Yeah. Shit started getting shit as the world progressed. 
for the final question and for the final 500 points, the answer is C, 1980s. Two, three, four, five, bam. The 1960s is when hitchhiking became illegal in California, especially 1959, according to Wikipedia. Oh, wait. Uh, boop, there it is. I know what I'm doing. I totally know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. Uh, yeah. All right. So, yeah, that's the game. And you, you said that was worth a thousand, didn't you? That was worth 500. I brought it down to 500 because that's more fair. <laughs> I know, I know. If that was a thousand, you would have won. But no, you didn't. So, in first, we have Straw Hat Axiom. Congratulations. Congratulations. Pew, pew, pew. Thank you. You are now eligible to enter the winner. This tournament. This tournament. There's going to be a couple more, and then we'll get a winner's tournament, and blah, 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 blah. blah. None of this has like been fair. Back. Of course not, Runa. You think this is supposed to be fair? No. Wrong. <laughs> Incorrect. This has been fun. Oh, it's been fun. That, that's the point. <laughs> and Love your it. second place, Laird, the Scottish Delight, Forbes. <laughs> Woo! Our kilts are played. And then in third, we got Shy the Trash Panda. Oh yeah, look how cute she is. Assisted by the most adorable assistant on the planet, Harley. Beep, 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 beep. I think it's this one. Well, that's just. No. No. No, there it is. <laughs> adorable, adorable. Adorable. And last but certainly not least, the lovable, the adorable ghost kitty with the most itty. Uh, that sounded weird. Fraggle Pop! Boo, boo, boo. Can I please get some shout outs for all of these amazing, amazing, amazing streamers? Amazing streamers. So we have a bit of time. Up next is DMCA. Now it's time for me to sell a little bit of my soul. Is that the one? No, that's not the one. That's the one. We're just going to stay on this one. DMCA is a DMG podcast, Dark Mode Gaming, and DMCA stands for Dark Dark Mode Cinema Academy, which is an amazing, amazing movie review podcast. Um, and it's going to have special guests featuring potentially uh, uh, videos or the actual guests themselves of um of people who are in the movie some juggalo references in and out there amazing people amazing um just an overall really smart bunch of people really that's that's the best way i can describe it so please hang around please hang around sure to hang it out and I would like, before we get into all of that, more of this stuff, so I can stretch and vamp, um, what were y'all thoughts on this Halloween's Halloween game show? What, what did y'all think? Did you guys have fun? I know your face hurts from laughing this and stuff. This great. Yeah? Super fun. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Super loved amazing. It. I've never done something like this. <laughs> to be yeah, honest, you should just do Very an entire fun. segment of improv. Like, that... That was, I enjoy improv. As much as I don't want to admit it, I did too. <laughs> you all did so good. Oh my God. Like, honestly, I, I hate to say it, but my favorite part was Laird telling, saying, fuck that bitch. That was hilarious, beyond hilarious. Oh my God. Oh shit. That was the oh, best. I'll, I'll, I would obviously never say that about you in real life. Oh, I know, but I'm you. so glad you did. <laughs> I'm so glad you did. All right. When, so the, camera, was... put, when the cameras are rolling, anything goes. Absolutely. And I appreciate that. So what are, were, were all some of the favorite moments of this? I know we just experienced it, but like, what, was, what were you thinking coming into this for maybe future contestants? Were, like, were you nervous? Were you like, oh, I'm so excited. Or like, I got this. Anything? Anyone? Just chime in. Oh, I was oh, hella nervous. nervous. I don't yeah, do good was... under pressure, and my brain shuts off, so some of those questions I feel like 
I would have gotten. I was pretty close, and I'm like, my brain just shuts off. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I love the improv the most as well. I agree with Shy. I think that was fantastic. Oh, absolutely. I feel like the improv itself should be its own segment. I The creativity you come up with is very immaculate, and then just having people try to play it out makes it even better. It's just something that I feel like anyone could do. Immaculate. Immaculate. Very, like, D&D-esque. That was Even though I've never played D&D. I love D&D. &D. I, yeah. so I hear it all the time. I'm doing voices. <laughs> <laughs> well, not to give any spoilers away, but the Christmas episode, I have a very special thing planned for DMG. It's the Lulu who stole Christmas. That's right. I'm saying it right here, right now. Four lucky contestants who have already been picked, and you know your names. You know your faces. Sexy faces, that is. Are going to go on one hell of an Adventure Time Christmas. But any... Any, uh, any... Did you have any, like, oh-no thoughts when you were in the middle of the game? You're like, oh, man, I, I have it. I can catch up to this person, but oh, no! I fucked up. Did you do? Did you have any of those moments? And like, what were your thoughts on them? I did. Oh, I, I, I immediately, I immediately regretted when I seen the Batman improv because I reckon I could have been a good Batman. Can we get a bit of your Batman? Can can we get a little bit of Batman from everyone? We did. We got a little taste, but can we get a little bit? Just a little, just a little. Just Now you're on the spot. I'm, fuck I'm fucking Batman. <laughs> I'm a Scottish Batman, you can. And my pal Robin has left me. But it's all right, because I'm here. My parents are dead. <laughs> but I'm Batman. My question is, is George your Robin? <laughs> that was amazing. <laughs> Oh, shit. Shy, do you have a Batman? Do I have a Batman? Yeah. Like another No, you do, thing? but I just want to hear you do it again. <laughs> hold on, hold on, let me wet my whistle real quick. Hold on. <laughs> my parents are dead. <laughs> I'm Batman. My Ooh. parents are dead. Fuck you, Lair. <laughs> Why is Batman swearing so much? <laughs> Dude, that's just me, man. Oh my gosh. I'm, I'm, that was fantastic. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so much for giving that little bit of little bit of voice for the samples. And Fraggle, do you have a Batman? Oh god. Uh You didn't I'm think Batman. you were <laughs> Where's Rachel? <laughs> Gordon. Where... <laughs> Can, 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 can you give me a? Can, can you give me a? What are they doing at the docks? What are they doing at the docks? <laughs> I swear to God, I don't know. <laughs> swear to me. Swear, swear to me. Swear to me. <laughs> I can't do it. That's gonna hurt. <laughs> swear to me. Uh. Oh my God. Straw hat, you're up next, fam. Let's hear this Batman voice. Well, as everyone else has said, I'm Batman. Holy fuck. That's I need great. justice. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's fuck that bitch. <laughs> that's all I got. <laughs> that's really good. <laughs> I still don't oh, know why God. you're making Batman swear. Ah. <laughs> that one was for you, Lulu. I know. I know. <laughs> you said fuck that bitch. <laughs> it can only mean one person. Oh my god. Well, I'm not going to embarrass you guys with mine. So we'll just keep on rolling. Now, I don't know what else. I don't know how else to vamp for seven more minutes. Fuck. Uh, right? That's six. Yeah, okay. That's right. Shy on some, is, is Shy up next too? Uh, yeah, I'm up for DMCA. Yeah, because yeah. it did. Uh, Dark mode yeah. gaming did take kick shy out. <laughs> Everyone, I I will go on to my own accord so you guys can continue <laughs> to vamp. 
<laughs> All right. Thank you so much, Shy. Thank you for playing. I love your face. You did great too. today. Thank you, guys. You did amazing. So proud of you. Hi, Thank you so much for <laughs> filling in. Because... Go ahead. Leave. Go. No. I'll, I'll talk oh. good about you when you're gone. Okay, good. <laughs> Um, Shy was actually a last second fill in. So she is a total lifesaver. And let's make myself a little bit equal there. Yeah. Well, no, yeah, no, yeah. Uh. Rachel! Rachel! You're a gift of a gang of psychopaths. Ah, uh, yes. We are the League of Shadows. I want my kitty boo boo. <laughs> Uh, I'm just okay. I know I know how we're gonna end this So this is something that I love doing on my stream and if you have not followed me yet Let me tell you a little about myself. Let me vamp on me a little bit. My name is Lulu But you can call me LH see what I did there. That's my stream title name um, But I am a voice actor I am a hell of a person, super cute, super cute. But what I like to do most is entertain my friends. And you follow me and you show up to my stream, you are automatically my friend. So one of the most requested things on my stream is the Joker monologue. Mm hmm. I can't be ready till she's here. Yeah, okay, that, that makes total sense. So what we're gonna do with all of these amazing people in the background, we are going to do the Joker monologue. If you're a fan of the Dark Knight, buckle up your seat belts because you're about to go on a ride. Dark Knight. <clears throat> this might be the only thing that really uh, might be get, you know, the whole, oh, you can't play that song on here, DMCA'd, which is the name of the next show. Isn't that ironic? <clears throat> hey, do you want to know how I got these scars? You see, my father was a drinker and a fiend. And one night he goes off crazier than usual. Mommy gets the kitchen knife to defend herself. He doesn't like that. Not one bit. So... With me watching, he takes the knife to her, laughing while he does it. Looks at me and says, why so serious? He sticks my gums at me with the knife. Why so serious, son? He sticks the blade in my mouth. Let's put a smile on that face. And... Why so serious? Happy Halloween, motherfuckers! Love you, DMG! Mwah! All right, I'm done. Someone hit the end button. Oh, wait, I gotta hit the end button. <laughs> all right, there it is. Wait, so no, yep. Love you all. Bye! Bye! Bye. Bye.